first. It's the first day of NaNoWriMo. It's 9.16 a.m. and I am very tired because I forgot that today was daylight savings time. And so I woke up at 7 a.m. instead of at 8 a.m. So if I'm tired today and I don't write as many words as I plan to, I'm blaming not myself. <laughs> I've already ported my 15k pre-NaNoWriMo words into my NaNoWriMo site page and when I did that it was like you're gonna finish if you stay on this track you're gonna finish by today and you've done like 900% of the words you needed to for today so that was funny to look at but it doesn't help me when trying to like calculate how long it'll actually take me to finish but yesterday night Last night, I calculated how many words I'd have left to write to get to 50k, and then I calculated how many words I have to write per day. So even if NaNoWriMo's site won't tell me how many words I need, I'm good to go and I know how many words I need. So every single day so far, if I stay on track, I only have to write 1200 words a day. I'm going to start with a 10 minute sprint to warm myself up for writing for the day, and then I'll see where I'm going to go from there. So, I'll keep you updated. <laughs> I can already tell that it's going to be a long month because I just finished the 10 minute writing sprint and I only wrote 81 words and I'm now seeing that me thinking, oh wow, it'll be so easy to write 50k. I'll be fine. This year's gonna be so different. I'm planning all these fun things. I'm gonna do writing a whole book. And then the second I start writing, I go, nope, nope, change my mind. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> so, yeah. Hopefully, it's just me being tired. But potentially, this is going to be a very, very long month. <laughs> I'm going to do another 10 minute sprint and hope that this time I can write more than 81 words. I think it's possible. Will I actually do it though? Potentially. Potentially not. We'll just have to see and I'll update you when it's done. <laughs> Okay, update. I only wrote 108 words. It's technically better, but also technically not. So I think I'm gonna try and do a few more writing sprints and then update you again so I can update you with more than just 100 words. So I'll probably see you in like an hour or two. It is now 11.33 and I've only added like 100 more words to my word count. So, yeah, not going well still, but I think I'm gonna take a break and eat lunch, and then I'm gonna go back to writing and try and force myself to write even though I hate everything I'm writing. I just have to go write. So yeah, off to lunch, and then back to writing.
It's 11.55 right now and I was planning on going right back to writing after I finished eating lunch, but I'm really tired so I'm thinking I'm going to take a nap and hope that that gives me all the energy I need and then after my nap I'm gonna go back to writing. So I'll update you after my nap and after I actually make some progress. So maybe see you in an hour, maybe see you in a lot of hours. So I'll update you when I can. <laughs> It is about 5.40 right now, and I just finished eating dinner, and even though I only got 700 words so far today and I need like 500 more words to get to my goal, I'm gonna call it here because I actually have a bunch of chores I need to get done and I also need to edit this footage from today. So I think I'm going to do that and then tomorrow just write all the words that I need to do for that day's goal and then also write the extra 500 from today so i think that's a good plan so i'll see you in a moment and it'll be day two of NaNoWriMo it is 1 12 on november 2nd and i've only just now started writing because i slept in and then i took a shower so i'm only just now like getting in the zone and ready to do everything so I have to write like 2,000 words today but I've started writing a little bit already and it's like kind of going okay so I think I probably should do some sprints and then see where that takes me it's 4 40 right now and I'm only about like halfway to my word count goal for today so I have a feeling this is going to be a trend for the entire month where I only do half of the amount of words I needed. But I did actually finish writing one of my chapters, so I'm thinking I might, instead of trying to write chronologically for the rest of the day, I'm just going to jump to scenes anywhere in the book that I want to write and just write some of those because creatively I'm just struggling to just write whatever and go. So hopefully I can get the other, like, 600, 700 words that I need for the day done by just writing a bunch of different things randomly or just writing one big thing but I'm definitely, yeah, I'm definitely not writing anymore of where I was because what I'm writing right now is a lot of Peter Pan and Ella and the Lost Boys just like living life and that's kind of hard for me to do it's like my least favorite part of writing the book so far so I'm kind of just like well, if I can avoid doing that, I'm going to avoid doing that. <laughs> so, I'm thinking I'm going to write after dinner, because it's almost dinner time, and hopefully get actual words that I like down on the paper today. And then if that goes well, then I'll also get ahead and write the extra, like, 500 words or whatever that I needed from yesterday, so that I'm even more on track than NaNoWriMo actually needs me to be. So... I will see you again after dinner. Okay, so it's after midnight, and while I said I would write after dinner, I didn't actually write after dinner. I actually just spent like the past like five hours finishing my playthrough of Fire Emblem. So I'm gonna go to bed now, and I'm gonna stop making promises that I'll write, because I know I'll never end up writing when I promise to. So the only promise I'll make is I'll write a little bit every single day, but the amount I'll write is not a promise that I can ever make. So I got halfway to my goal, so I guess that's okay. But, yeah. So, I can promise I'll see you tomorrow. Can't promise how much I'll be writing tomorrow, but it'll happen at least a little bit. So. It is 1.45 and I've written about 500 words so far today. 
and so it's actually going pretty well and again I said I'm not gonna make any more promises but I'm thinking today I actually will probably be able to get to my workout goal. Also, I'm sorry that this vlog very quickly became very boring to watch because I'm basically just updating like once a day being like, I didn't write anything, goodbye. But yeah, <laughs> I don't have anything else to say about that. I'm gonna try to make it more interesting as the days go on, but this first week probably will be a bit boring. But yeah, I'm taking a break and I'm gonna play, start playing another Root of Fire Emblem. So, that'll be fun, but then after I'm done doing that, I'm going to go back to writing. Because I'm actually enjoying what I'm writing, because what I just wrote was a scene where Ella meets the crocodile, like the one that has the, the clock in its like stomach or whatever. So that was an interesting scene to write because it's kind of important and stuff. So, that was fun. I haven't like fully finished it, but like the important part is done, so. So yeah, I will see you later, and I'll update you with how my writing's going, and maybe I'll film some writing time lapses or something, so. right now and I'm actually at 874 words so that's almost like 900 words and that's the most I've gotten so far on these past three days so that's cool but more importantly it means I'm only like 300 words away from my goal of getting 1200 words each day as like the average so I think I'm actually gonna reach my goal for once so that's really exciting. I'm actually like slowly liking more and more of what I'm writing and I think the jumping to scenes I actually want to write idea was a good idea. So really excited about that. I think I'm probably going to write the rest of the words I need and then give you one final update for the day and then go to bed and then start day four. <laughs> so I will see you in a second and I will tell you just how many words I write as my final word count for the day. This is absolutely an accident and not at all on purpose, but my final word count for the day ended up being exactly 1200 words. Like I finished what I planned on working on and like I didn't really have that much else to say and I was like, oh, I'll just go and check how many words I wrote during that little area of time and I'll put it into NaNoWriMo's site and I'll see how many more words I'll need. And then it came out as a perfect 1200 words. So I think that's quite funny and a perfect note to end day three on. So, I will leave it there, and I will see you tomorrow, and hopefully this good energy continues on throughout the rest of the week, because I could use it. <laughs> It is 10.41 right now, and I've barely written at all today, like I might have written like 200 words so far or something. 
And something I'm discovering pretty quickly is the fact that my interest in writing this story is dwindling. But I know that if I were just to decide, hey, I'm just not going to write this story, that I'd feel so guilty. And like, I've been working on this story for so long and I like care about telling the story, but I just... <laughs> I write such bad and like messy first drafts and it's just hurting every time I have to write <laughs> because I know I have to write the horrible prose of the first draft to then be able to write the better prose of future drafts but ugh, I just want it to be over and it's not over so I think that's probably why I'm having trouble writing at all and also probably why I'm like not vlogging because I'm like I don't want to vlog me saying I've written nothing yet today so I'm just not filming anything so if I write any more significant amount of words tonight before I go to bed I'll update on how many words I have but otherwise this is the last clip of <laughs> Thursday so Hopefully I write a bunch more words tomorrow, but I also have to edit this vlog tomorrow night, so I might have to cut my words short if I don't get my words done during, like, the beginning of the day. So, probably see you tomorrow. It is 12.02 right now, so it's basically midnight, and so it's now day 6, or November 6th, and my final word count for... November 5th ended up being 701 words, so since I last spoke to you, I wrote like 500 words. <laughs> so I actually was successful because I just started writing. I was writing a scene, or not a scene, the scene, it's a pretty important scene, where Ella and Peter Pan and all the Lost Boys are fighting on the Jolly Roger for the first time, and it's when Ella ends up meeting Captain Hook for the first time, and so I think I just got in enough of a zone to like do just snippets of that like event happening and so I actually have some semi-decent things I wrote so that's good. It's more important that I wrote 701 words today so basically what I've learned from this is you're not done writing words for the day until the day is over. So if you're worried about writing words and you haven't written words yet, but the day isn't over, you can still get more words. <laughs> so now I won't worry as much because I know also that if I have a deadline of the day's gonna end and then you won't be able to update your words for the day anymore because it'll be the next day that I'll want to write more words and I'll just start writing whatever I'm thinking and not judging what the words I'm about to write up will just go. <laughs> so I'll see you tomorrow and hopefully I'll talk a lot more about writing a lot of words <laughs> because hopefully I'll actually reach my word count goal one of these days instead of just writing half the words I need and then only having one day where I meet the exact number of words I need. <laughs> so bye! <laughs> bye until tomorrow!